Hi everyone, Sean with jazbeescasebreaks.com here doing 2021 Tops Finest Baseball 8 box case break. Pick your team number 9 where all card chip uh, and we're looking for the case hit of the Kintsu Kuroi. It's the uh, beautiful black gold or red gold parallel. Uh, here's our full list of teams and respective customers. Nicholas Wheat, Diamondbacks, down to Chris Walker and the Nationals. And here's that list in person. And here's our box. 2021 Finest. You can see written faintly right there. So there are the eight boxes for us. And eight left in the next four, the collectors. Yeah, Steve, Jonathan picked up the uh, last spot. I think Orioles, right? So I'll, uh, once I'm done with this break, I'll go through orders um, and add that to the schedule. But I'm pretty sure that's the only thing that's going to be on there uh, as of yet. <laughs> so, oh, Steve, he just did it on the one team just to get that closed out since obviously it was just sitting there, you know? Uh, Joe, by the way, um, since you're here, 
I was trying to turn on the Nick Cam when I was on the uh, the the computer screen, shade like the shared screen, and for some reason the Nick Cam wouldn't pop on, um, even though it was on the very top of the thing. So it should have like obviously been able to you know pop up over whatever else was on the screen, but for some reason it wasn't coming on. So I'm not sure if that's something you saw earlier today or, or something I screwed up, but just a heads up if you want to look at that tomorrow. Hey, there's nothing wrong with being frugal. That's how the richest people in the world stay the richest people in the world. That's actually compound interest. No, it's on now. But if I'm on the shared screen when I'm like trying to show a random or uh, like the the spreadsheet or like random.org or anything like that, because um, I was trying to do it where we picked like I had the trade window open as I was picking the boxes for NT. And I was trying to keep the boxes on screen, or at least on a screen, while I popped back over to print out the randomizer and see if there was any trades that we were going to do. Um, but it wouldn't turn on. Like I kept clicking it, and it kept registering on uh, on OBS that I was clicking it to turn on, but it never showed on the screen. So. Oh. It still oh okay. It still says Nick Cam on there, so maybe that just needs to be deleted, I guess. Makes sense. I just thought I was like, I thought maybe I'd done something. I was like, I'm just glad you're here because I would have totally forgot to mention it in our in our messaging. We got a bat knob, Joe, out of our uh, our tier one break. Last box, I kind of was joking. I was like, oh, please be a bat knob and. Popped open the box and there it was. It was Mr. Gary Cotter. The kid before the kid. Uh, no, this is a, uh, I mean, it's still number 27. It's Mike Trout. This is the new uh, the new Nike jerseys, so only current players. Yeah, the kid before the kid. I don't think Nike has done any old school players yet. Hence the swoosh. But I was discussing my next jersey. Um, I haven't seen them yet. But I, I'm going to have to get an Otani All-Star game jersey since I'm going to be at the Home Run Derby. I got to get one. And I was saying, like, since it's an NL park and it's at it's at it's in Colorado, I have a feeling that the NL team is going to get the cooler of the, the two colorways. But it's Rockies colors, you know, colored theme. Which I'm hoping there's, like, just awesome purple and black mixtures in there which i'm down for i would love to have the al be like a straight up purple or pinstripe of some sort i know i'm gonna get an otani jersey i tried to convince joe i tried to convince my buddy who has the otani uh the otani bowman chrome red auto BGS like nine five ten or whatever. <laughs> I tried to convince him to do whatever the Paul brother did for his fight, where he uh, he wore it as a necklace into the ring. I told him to to do that for the uh, for the home run derby. Just wear that, wear the uh, red auto out of five. 
into the home run derby. I don't know if he will. Uh, Otani is absolutely killing it. Went uh, went six innings today. Another nine strikeouts. No decision. Gave up one run. Lowered his ERA. It's insane. Kevin Gaussman, though, made him look ridiculous at the plate today. He had him all over it. Right? I thought that was so cool. I was like, yeah, let's do it. He told me, he's like, you know what? I'm thinking about it now. Yeah, he's an, yeah you can't, I mean, I was, I was saying that the other day. Like, what Otani's doing is incredible. And I, and, I mean, I shouldn't come be complaining because you can still make money off of it. But it doesn't make any sense to me how Vlad Jr. still has better odds for MVP than Otani does. Even though they have the same amount of home runs, and like when I was talking about it on Monday or whatever, they had the same amount of home runs. Otani had uh, like five RBIs less and like six runs less. But he has pitching, wins, innings pitched, strikeouts, all that stuff. It's so weird. So I was like, wait a second. I was like, how is Vladdy plus 105 for AL MVP and Otani is plus 150? I was like, it doesn't make any sense to me. Yeah, I mean, and that's the thing is like, I was telling, I was telling, uh, I was complaining about it to uh, to Thomas, and he's like, well, Otani's more likely to get hurt, and I was like, well, I get that, but betting odds aren't, I was like, betting odds aren't like likelihood of getting hurt, you know what I mean? I was like, like uh, betting odds are currently right now based on stats and everything, who are. You know who's most likely, and it's definitely Otani. So, yeah, as soon as he announced the home run derby, like I immediately had to. I, I I'm already gonna be in Denver. Like I was gonna be in Denver, leaving Sunday the day before the home run derby. So I had to adjust my plans to stay through the home run derby. But his swing is so so simple. And like effortless, that I honestly think he might have a really good chance of winning the home run derby. It's gonna be so much fun. Any basketball breaks close but open? Um, I think I think so, Ryan. Hopefully they're getting a lot of money, Joe. We were telling people at the beginning of the season, before the season, we were telling people to bet on him. We thought I I kept I mean. You agreed. You were like, yeah, that's actually a really good value play. Otani for AL MVP at plus somebody somebody that I told to do that, Joe, got him at plus 1750. I was like, "Oh my god." So, so far, you got Shohei Otani and Pete Alonso in the home run derby. I haven't heard anybody else announce or announce themselves yet. Yeah, Vlad's having an incredible, incredible season. Yeah, plus 1750. So a 1600 point swing on that bet already. I was like, oh my god. I was so jealous. I was like, well, good for you. <laughs> and a bunch of other people were like, yeah, I took your advice. They're like, I took your advice, and they, uh, um, I was like, oh, did you put a bet on it? They're like, no, but I bought a bunch of his rookies before the season. And I was like, well, that's even better, because now you can sell him off throughout the season, even if he doesn't win AL MVP, and still just cash in. Oh, and that, uh, that Prism first off the line, Ryan, um, if you get two teams, you also get entered uh, for a chance to win the Hornets, which obviously is the most expensive team possible. So, um, If you're going to get a team, make sure you get two. And if you're going to get two, get four. So instead of looking at it as 12 teams available, look at it as six purchases instead of 12. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, and I agree too, Joe. I thought that that's what they were doing with uh, Lamelo for Rookie of the Year. I didn't think he had. A, I didn't think he was going to win it, but 
that's the weird part, man. I 100% thought that they were balancing out the bets by by trying to get more money on uh, by trying to get people to throw money at Lamelo, you know. But I was extremely shocked to see him actually win it. That makes the other teams too much for my liking. Okay. Sounds good. Well, that's what I was saying. That's what I would thought, Joe. But remember, the odds were they, the odds kept getting better and better for Lamelo. It was weird. Like I was just like, wait a second. I don't understand this. Looking for that Kintsuko Roy. Case hit. And our first auto is Andres Jimenez. 41 out of 50 gold rookie auto for the Mets and Daniel Ousley. Tristan McKenzie to 199 for the Indians, Daniel Ousley. Dylan Carlson for the Cardinals and Ryan Maloney. And Ian Anderson for the Braves. Josh, uh, sorry, Joseph Ivers. Bobby Dahlbeck for the Red Sox. Ike Capola, Jake Cronenworth for the Padres. And Shane Warner. Joey Bart for the Giants. Arthur King. Luis Garcia to 175. For the Nationals, Chris Walker. Casey Mize for the Tigers. Daniel Ousley and Sixto Sanchez for the Marlins. And Patrick Davis. Alex Kirloff, rookie auto to 99 for the Twins. Nicholas Wheat and Kyle Lewis for the Mariners. Andrew Martin. Kettle Marte to 150 for the Diamondbacks, Nicholas Wheat. Christian Pache for the Braves, Josh, uh, Joseph Ivers. And Lewin Diaz to 250 for the Marlins, Patrick Davis. Max Kepler for the Twins, Nicholas Wheat. Um, no, he's over on uh, he's on Instagram, Joe. I'll have to ask. Uh, I'll I'll ask when I'm on this weekend. I'm sure somebody. But I know I know a bunch of people got in when he was like fourteen hundred. I I but one guy one guy said that he like shopped around and he found he found one place that was offering seventeen fifty. I was just like, holy shit. Dylan Carlson for the Cardinals. Ryan Maloney. Mauricio Dubon for the Giants. Rookie auto, Arthur King. And Alex Kirloff out of 125 for the Twins. Nicholas Wheat. Jack Flaherty for the Cardinals. Ryan Maloney and Christian Pache for the Braves. Joseph Ivers. You got Michael Conforto to 250 for the Mets and Daniel Ousley. Jackie Bradley Jr. for the Brewers, David Shaw. Oh, 
No, I'm I'm heavily rooting for those people. Heavily rooting for those people. It's funny because I didn't do any I didn't do any bets on it. I got I got cards, but I didn't get put any money on the MVP bet. Dylan Carlson, rookie auto. We've had some really nice rookie autos so far. Cardinals, Ryan Maloney. Uh, Buster Posey to 300 for the Giants. And Arthur King. Bobby Dahlback, Red Sox. I Capola, Jake Cronenworth for the Padres. Shane Warner. Debbie Garcia for the Yankees. Zane Christian and Joey Bart for the Giants. Arthur King. Joe Adele for the Angels. Joe Medeiros. And Trevor Bauer. I don't know why that was flipped around. William Contreras for the Braves. Joseph Ivers. Joe, my my next big my, my next play this off season. Yeah, um, my next play next season, Joe. I'm gonna wait until uh, Ben Simmons market bottoms out. I'm going all. I'm gonna go after his. You don't think that you don't think Philadelphia is gonna improve next season? Come on. Luis Garcia, rookie auto to ninety nine for the Nationals and Chris Walker. Jesus Sanchez to one twenty five for the Marlins. Patrick Davis. Joe Adele for the Angels. Joe Maderos. And Joey Gallo for the Rangers. I Capola. Absolutely, Camiano. Thank you very much for getting in again. Congrats. One Jordan Love was good. Two was better. Yon Mankata. It's a 250 for the White Sox. Joe Christian. And Marcus Simeon for the Blue Jays. Dylan Brinson. Christian Pache for the Braves. Joseph Ivers. That's the thing, Joe, is like people are so down on him. They're saying he's washed, that he's done, no, he can't do anything, he's the worst, blah, 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 blah. I'm going to benefit from it. Yeah, yeah. I was saying the same thing as uh, Paul George, except for nobody really thinks, I mean, unless old, old like people remembering Paul George, nobody thinks Paul George is, you know, can be what Ben Simmons is or could be. But I, th I have a feeling that they're going to do uh, only only get better for them next year. Tristan McKenzie, rookie auto to 25. A little bit of surface scratching up on top, unfortunately. But very nice, rookie auto to 25 for the Indians. That is Daniel Ousley. Manny Machado to 150 for the Padres. And Shane Warner. Pete Alonso for the Mets. Daniel Ousley. Sixers' mistake was uh, hiring, um, what's his name? Ryan Mountcastle for the Orioles, Tom Jones. Joey Votto for the Reds to 250. Daniel Ousley. And Alex Kirilov for the Twins, Nicholas Wheat. Braylon Marquez for the Cubs, Daniel Ousley. Yeah, I mean... I honestly think like this the Sixers biggest mistake was hiring uh hiring what's his name Doc Rivers. That guy has shown that all he can do is take a team that's good and not do anything with them. Make them lose. It's, it's pretty bad. Santiago Espinal Bowman uh rookie auto for the Blue Jays, Dylan Brinson. And Chris Sale to 199 for the Red Sox. I Capola. Alec Baum for the Phillies. Daniel Ousley. Bobby Dahlback for the Red Sox. I Capola. Jake Crodeworth for the Padres. Shane Warner. And Aaron Nola to 175 for the Phillies. Daniel Ousley. Joey Bart for the Giants. Arthur King. Jazz Chisholm for the Marlins. Patrick Davis and Nick Madrigal for the White Sox. Joe Christian. I mean, look what a uh, look what the the look what the Clippers did last year, right? 
They got up and then they lost with Doc Rivers. You can't say that this year that that team is considerably better than it was last year at all. Yet this year they were behind and they've gotten they've still won. You know what I mean? So it's clearly the coaching that's the difference. So Casey Mize for the Tigers. Daniel Ousley and Kent Herbeck auto to 150 for the Twins. Nicholas Wheat. Cody Bellinger for the Dodgers. Nicholas Wheat. And Nolan Arenado to 250 for the... I'm sorry, to 150 for the Cardinals. Ryan Maloney. Alec Baum again for the Phillies. Daniel Ousley. Nick Madrigal for the White Sox. Joe Christian. And Casey Mize to 250 for the Tigers. Daniel Ousley, Christian Pache for the Braves, Joseph, uh, Joseph Ivers. And Zach Granke for the Astros, Daniel Ousley. Yeah, I think I think Ben Simmons got the yips, guys. I honestly think he just got the yips. He got scared. He's too scared to shoot again. But he just needs to have somebody get him over that, and he's, he's going to be fine. Alec Baum, Phillies. Daniel Ousley. JoJo Romero for the Phillies. Daniel Ousley. Kyle Lewis to 300 for the Mariners. Andrew Martin. Bo Bichette for the Blue Jays. Dylan Brinson. K. Brian Hayes for the Pirates. Chad Daw. Jazz Chisholm for the Marlins. Patrick Davis. Clayton Kershaw to 99 for the Dodgers. Nicholas Wheat. K. Brian Hayes again for the Pirates. Chad Daw and Giancarlo Stanton for the Yankees. Zane Christian. Yeah. Doc Rivers isn't the kind of guy that can get get a person, like coach a person out of the mental blocks that are causing him his issues. He's not that coach. Luis Camposano, rookie auto for the Padres. Shane Warner. And Anthony Rendon to 125 for the Angels. Joe Medeiros. Ryan Mountcastle for the Orioles. Tom Jones. Trevor Story for the Rockies and and uh, Andrew Dawson, Alex Kirilov for the Twins, Nicholas Wheat, Jazz Chisholm to 250 for the Marlins, Patrick Davis, Joe Adele for the Angels, Joe Medeiros, and Shane Bieber for the Indians, Daniel Ousley. We got three boxes left. No case hit yet. Ryan Mountcastle for the Orioles. Tom Jones. JT Realmuto for the Phillies. Daniel Ousley. And William Contreras Gold to 50. For the Twins. Nicholas Wheat. Alex Kirilov for the Twins, Nicholas Wheat, Ryan Mountcastle, Orioles, Tom Jones, Debbie Garcia to 250 for the Yankees, Zane Christian, Casey Mize for the Tigers, Daniel Ousley and Alec Baum for the Phillies, Daniel Ousley, Alex Kirilov for the Twins, Nicholas Wheat. Nick Madrigal for the White Sox, Joe Christian, Ryan Mountcastle for the Orioles, Tom Jones. Okay, 
Inoli Paredes, rookie auto for the Astros. That is Daniel Owsley and Matt Chapman to 300 for the A's. David Shaw. K. Brian Hayes for the Pirates. Chad Daw. Juan Soto for the Nationals. Chris Walker. Jazz Chisholm for the Marlins. And Patrick Davis. Nolan Arenado to 75 for the Cardinals. Ryan Maloney. Joe Adell. Angels. Joe Maderos. And Javi Baez for the Cubs. Daniel Owsley. K. Brian Hayes, Rookie Auto. Very nice. Pirates, Chad Daw. This has been a really good case for Rookie Autos. Clark Schmidt to 99 for the Yankees. Zane Christian. Clark Schmidt for the Yankees. Zane Christian. Ryan Mountcastle. Orioles. Tom Jones. Glaber Torres to 175 for the Yankees. Zane Christian, K. Brian Hayes again for the Pirates, Chad Da, Jake Cronenworth, Padres, Shane Warner and Keeper Ruiz for the Dodgers, Nicholas Wheat, Jazz Chisholm for the Marlins, Patrick Davis. Aaron Judge for the Yankees, Zane Christian, and Spencer Howard to 300 for the Phillies, Daniel Owsley, Yadier Molina for the Cardinals, Ryan Maloney, Casey Mize for the Tigers, Daniel Owsley, Alec Baum for the Phillies, Daniel Owsley, Nick Madrigal for the White Sox, Joe Christian and Aaron Judge to 199 for the Yankees, Zane Christian, Bobby Dahlbeck. Red Sox, I Capola, Jake Cronenworth for the Padres, Shane Warner and Christian Pache for the Braves, Joseph Ivers, JT Realmuto for the Phillies, Daniel Owsley and Joey Bart for the Giants, Arthur King. Cool. Last box. So this should have our case hit. Let's see it. Tarek Skubal, rookie auto for the Tigers. And Daniel Ousley. Jordan Alvarez to 50 for the Astros. Daniel Ousley. Jesus Sanchez for the Marlins. Patrick Davis. Ryan Mountcastle for the Orioles. And Tom Jones. Alex Kirloff for the Twins. Nicholas Wheat. Dylan Carlson for the Cardinals. And Ryan Maloney. Mookie Betts to one, 250 for the Dodgers. Nicholas Wheat. Mike Trout for the Angels. Joe Maderos. Last half of the last box for our case hit. Come on. Make it big. Wow. That's good. Finest moments. Ronald Acuna Jr. for the Braves. Joseph Ivers. Beautiful. Kettle Marte at 75 for the Diamondbacks. Nicholas Wheat. What a great case. Garrett Cole for the Yankees. Zane Christian. Ooh, our case hit's coming up. It's a red gold. Hey, 
even shorter print. Key Brian Hayes for the Pirates. And it's rookie Alex Kirilov. Red gold. Kintsuke Kuroi. Twins. Nicholas Wheat. Michael Chavis. Non-numbered. Not sure why it was flipped around. Just gave us a little bit of a tease. Chris Bryant for the Cubs. Daniel Ousley. And there you go, guys. That was the break. No randomizers to do, but a very nice way to finish it. Acuna Auto, Alex Kirilov, Kintsuke Kuroi. Rookie, short print, case hit. The black gold is the regular version. The red gold is an even shorter print version. And honestly, even cooler looking, obviously. And there you go. That is 2021 Tops Finest Baseball 8 Box Case Break. Pick your team number nine from jazpyscasebreaks.com. I'm Sean, jazpyscasebreaks.com. Thanks for hanging out. We'll see you next time.